about it. I think there's there's how many characters in this game? 76? 77? I want 35. I want a 35 character roster. So I want a little over half gone. Yeah, I want a little over half gone. I want about yeah, I want 40 characters gone. <laughs> I want about 40. For those who may be new to the stream, here's who can fucking go. Who's here's who we don't need, right? And of course the original 12 have to say they're the OG 12. The Smash staples, such as you know, like Marth, Ganon, like they have to absolutely stay. The original 12 have to stay and whatnot, but the people who can fucking leave. Dr. Mario. Not that I have a problem with him, but it's just like, why? Oh, yo, what's up, Odin, baby? Dr. Mario can go. Pichu can go. Sure, they don't take up an extra character slot, but it's just like, she's dry bread. Lucina can go. Young Link can go. Krom can go. I would like Roy to stay, but if he were to be gone, I would personally be okay with that. But I feel like Roy is like a, a smash staple. You know, not so much as much as Marth, but I think he is. But I'd be okay. I wouldn't be upset if you were gone. But Krom absolutely needs to go. Dark Pit can go. Snake, get this motherfucker out of here. Get him out of here. Get this. I press the B button and then I hold the shield button, bitch, out of this game. Ike has to stay. Ike has to, I looked over. I was like, wait, I'm on Pokemon Trainer. Ike has to stay. No, Ike is a smash staple. Ike has to stay. He's too synonymous with the franchise in the series. Um, Pokemon Trainer can stay, but I would actually like new Pokemon. I wanted them to do this for Smash 4, but I wish like for every Smash game, you'd get new starters from like the next Pokemon game in the series. I think that'd actually be really cool. Diddy can stay. Diddy's like, you know, a smash character. You know what I mean? Lucas, I feel 50-50 on. Um, I wouldn't care if Lucas left, but I also think Lucas is kind of a Smash character. You know what I mean? Um, Sonic, get this spinning. I don't have to play neutral with you, motherfucker, out the game. King DD can stay. I, I hate him with a fucking passion, but he, he can stay. Olimar, I guess, is... It's synonymous with Smash, I, I suppose, but I would like for him to be fucking gone, but it's not going to happen. He will be back. Lucario, I feel like he can go. Not that I would be against him staying, but I think more so Lucario should be replaced, maybe, with like a newcomer. You know what I mean? But I definitely think Lucario can actually go. Rob, honestly, get this motherfucker out of here. To be honest with you, like, only Degenerates play Rob anyways. If, if Rob not being in the Smash game means those people aren't going to be playing Smash, fine by me. We don't want Rob mains in our community. Fuck him. Toon Link can go. Wolf can stay. Get Villager the fuck out of here. Get me It's not going to happen because Animal Crossing is too big of a Nintendo franchise, right? But if it were up to me, I'd cut that motherfucker and his little secretary, bitch, if it were up to me. Get Mega Man the fuck out of here. No one wants to fight against doo, 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 doo. Leaf Shield. Doo, 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 doo. Leaf Shield. Get him the fuck out of here. We fit. Belete this bitch from the game. She doesn't even play on the stage. She's a character where you play the character on the fucking ledge. You don't even use the stage that you select. Get this bitch the fuck out of here. Moves hitting on both sides and everything, man. Rosalina, she can go. Um, I don't really have a personal problem with her. I just feel like she's irrelevant. And the Rosalina fan base, as far as Smash goes, is so small. I don't think that small number of people is worth keeping her in the game. She can go. Little Matt can stay. Greninja, I don't have a problem with. He's one of the few Smash 4 characters I'm okay with. Um, I'd be okay with him leaving or going, but if he were to leave, he would have to get replaced. 
If he were to just leave and not get replaced, then I would have a small problem with that. But I think Greninja's fine. Greninja is one of the few Smash 4 newcomers that's actually a fucking Smash character. And he plays Smash. He plays Smash. Unlike most of these Smash 4 fucking newcomer motherfuckers. Politana can stay. Pac-Man, get this yellow fucking testicle fruit selecting. I'm going to chuck it at you. Fucking fire hydrant. Get the fuck away from me, bitch. Out the game. This character is Cancer Incarnate. And if you play Pac-Man, you are a fucking psychopath. Carrot Trees, thanks for the follow. If you play Pac-Man, you are psychotic, you are a psychopath, you are a sociopath, and you need to go to therapy. Robin can go. Not that I have a problem with the way Robin plays, but like I said, like let's just move on from Awakening, please, and Fates. Shulk already talked about before I saw this. Bowser Jr., should have never been the game in the first place. You had so many motherfuckers asking for him. Right? And then he comes out and no one fucking plays him. No one plays this character. They got him in this fucking uh, jack-in-the-box fucking cart. This character's fucking irrelevant. This character's corny. This character's cheesy as fuck. And he's not good. I consider Bowser Jr. the worst character in the game. So I'm not saying like, oh, he's like ridiculous or nothing. Like When I say he's corny and cheesy, I'm just saying like, why the fuck would anyone want to place this character in the fucking jack-in-the-box? Like, I, I don't understand that. If he was on foot, okay. But I was already like, there's too many Mario characters anyway. So, get rid of fucking Bowser Jr. And Rosalina can also go. Like, Duck Hunt? Out of here. Out of here. Just like the Rosalina fans, there's not enough Duck Hunt players to warrant keeping him in the game. No one likes fighting against the Duck Hunt. He's not fun to fight against. I don't find him fun to play as. I'm sorry, Gurgak. I don't know if you're in here. I've seen you in a while. But if you're watching... I'm sorry, Duck Hunt is just not a fun character. You guys already know how I feel about the third-party characters. All these motherfuckers can go. I hate Ryu and Ken. I wouldn't say they're quite as bad as the likes of Pac-Man. And others where I say like they're not Smash characters like Snake and stuff like that. But... They definitely don't feel like Smash characters to me. I can't even play these motherfuckers because they just feel so fucking different. You know what I mean? These two can fucking go. All the third parties can go, but if I were to say, like, okay, third party characters can stay, those are the reasons why I would want them gone. Cloud? I'm okay with I'm okay with Cloud moveset-wise outside of his up B. His up B is the only thing I have a fucking problem with because that shit out of S.H.I.E.L.D. is cancer. But otherwise, based off his design, the way he plays, he's fine. But just get him out of here because he's fucking cloud. Like, I don't know, man. I just, you guys, you, we were just talking about this before, you know, I, I started my viewer matches. I just don't care for cloud. I think cloud is a dry, bland character. But I know you guys are going to say he's the most iconic Final Fantasy character, which, yes, he is. So if anyone's going to represent the franchise, it'd be him. Me, personally, I don't give a fuck, but like I said, I want all third-party characters gone in general. Corrin, irrelevant, comes from a trash game, a game that promotes and is focused on fucking, you know, fucking incest and shit, like, fuck out of here. No one cares about Cor oh, Corrin, fuck out of here. Bayonetta, delete that thought, all right? She was broken in OP in Smash 4. Apparently, I don't agree with it, but apparently she's so bad in this game, she's unplayable. So, she's only been broken, and she's only been apparently unplayable. So, apparently there's no fucking winning, so just get this thought out the fucking game. And also, her fucking scream, every single time she gets hit, ah! Every single time she gets... It's annoying! She touches you with auto combos you can't get out of. Get Bayonetta out of here. Inkling's gonna stay because Splatoon is like Nintendo's most recent, you know, big, actually successful IP. So Inkling is gonna stay. I um, also think Inkling is salvageable. I hate Inkling with a passion. I think it's stupid that the hitbox almost completely basically goes away when they're dash dancing and going to the ink. The recovery's stupid, but I think all these things can be adjusted and salvaged at least. So if we're up to me, Inkling can stay. Yeah, Inkling just needs to get adjusted a bit. Ridley, I already talked about Ridley. Like, I don't have a problem with the way he's designed or anything. I think he's a fine character. 
he's already in the game. Of course, I don't agree with him being in the game. It's stupid that he's in the game. It's not really Ridley, but it's, it's like it's like whatever. He he can stay at this point since he's already in. If he was gone, I wouldn't care. If he stays, I wouldn't care. He, he's already been ruined. This already isn't actually Ridley. What 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 worse can be done? You know what I mean? The Belmonts said third party characters they can go. No one wants to fucking fight against them. K Rule. Everyone asks for him, but like no one's even really playing him. I mean, I guess people online play him, but as far as offline play, I see nobody playing this fucking character. So everyone asks for him, but then no one's playing him. And I feel like as popular of a request that he was. He's just kind of irrelevant. But I guess he could stay if he got a rework that would encourage people to play him. Um, I don't care if he if he left or went, but if you're up to me and I was restricting the roster to a 35-man roster, which is the size that I want, I'd probably remove him if I had to make space. If I had the space, he could stay. If I had to make space, he could go. Isabella already talked about with Villager. That secretary thought out of here. Only reason why people wanted her in the game is because they jack off to Rule 34, fucking, you know, yo, know, human fight, fucking furry board of her. Incineroar. This is kind of just a personal thing. Um, I've always hated Incineroar's design. I think he's stupid how he goes from a fucking quadruped cat to bipedal wrestlers. Like, you know, what the fuck happened? Where's the transition? You know what I mean? Like, Incineroar can go. I don't necessarily like just hate and with the burning passion. I'm mostly fine with the way he plays in Smash, so it's not like character salt towards him or anything. Before he was ever in Smash, I didn't like Incineroar. Is where this is coming from. Let me make sure that's clear. Um, but I think Incineroar would be one of those candidates that's like likely to just be replaced. So not so much he needs to go because he's just bad or irrelevant. I just think he'd be one of those characters that's very likely to be replaced by a newer Pokemon. I want a Sceptile. Or decision why it would have been dope as well, but Sceptile would have been a dope ass inclusion. Joker's third party, he needs to go. The fucking Mies. <laughs> Y'all already know the fucking deal. Y'all already know the fucking deal with the Mies. Cancer and Carnet, just like I said with Pac Man, if you main the Mies, you're a psychopath, you're a sociopath. You need to get help. Find a therapist. Go in for mental evaluation. Look at him. Look at him. Look at what you're playing. Look at these motherfuckers. They're so fucking corny. They're cheesy. Their special moves are, are, are dumb. They make the dumbest sounds. They look stupid. Their moves, their animations look so dumb. They... Hold up. They're cheese! They're cheesy as fuck! They're corny! They're irrelevant! They're not actual video game characters in the first place. They are fucking, you know what? This isn't even accurate because this is at least Fiesta Blend. Because I like making Mexican food. But they're fucking cheese. I should have just got fucking cheddar. Get the Mies out of this fucking game. This is a game about video game characters. The Mies aren't actual characters. The Mies are stupid generic dumb looking corny lame as fuck cheesy degenerate unfun inclusions in this game but that's the whole roster thank you for listening to the rant guys we'll get back to the viewer matches i just had to handle that real